Hi everyone. Today we're going to be walking through the diet and treatment survey and I'll be demonstrating some of the questions and how to navigate through here. I'm going to start by going to the participant's name. In this case it's Eileen 12 Blakely and you're going to see here shortly that it's going to load the surveys that I still need to take. And one of these is the treatment and diet survey. So I'm simply going to click on take. And this is going to take me to the screen where I have questions to answer. And we'll kind of walk through these one at a time. The first question is if the participant has ever been on a PKU diet. I'm going to answer yes. And the patient is currently on a diet. So again, I'm answering yes. And it's asking me what kind. In this case, um, my participant is on a low protein diet. Is the participant taking any low protein phenylalanine medical food or formula? And again, in this case, my patient is. I'm going to select the formula. Let's say in this case that it's phenylate essential. And the amount is 100 grams per day. And they ask how often the participant takes this. So this is how often they're compliant or they're uh, taking their formula as being requested. And I'm going to say all the time. My formula is taken all the time. Does the participant use any specialty low-protein modified foods? And in this case, we do. We use some of the low-protein cheeses and some pasta and some bread. And you can scroll down. There's many more here to choose from. Does this participant use any other treatments specifically for PKU? And in this case, um, the patient does not, so we're not going to click any. Does the participant record their low protein um, intake? Yes. And in this case, we happen to use grams of protein. Some people may record in milligrams of feed. And how much natural pro protein is prescribed? I'm going to say that I'm prescribed 10 grams of protein a day. The survey asks about the current age of the participant or if the uh, participant is deceased to the age that that happened. I'm going to say 12. We're asking for weight in kilograms. Uh, most often you will be using pounds, but I'm going to enter my height in centimeters by clicking on a number here. Uh, in this case, this was some information I made you to look up, and that was what's the participant's highest tested fee level. In this case, it was before diet began, and I'm going to put in 19.8. And the date, I'm going to say, was January 1st of 2001. Lowest fee level was 0 0.5, let's say. And I'm not really sure of when that date was, so I'm just going to leave that blank by now. How often does the participant go to see the, um, his physician in the clinic? And this time we go twice a year. How often does the participant actually test levels? I'm asked to do levels once a month, and actually they're done once a month. But in that case, you would put how often the levels are actually done. Does the participant test tyrosine at the same time uh, that phenylalanine is tested? And I'm not really sure about that, so I'm going to click don't know. And does the participant take complete metabolic blood tests? And these would be something that might be done annually by your physician. And I'm going to say yes. And in this case, they are done annually uh, when I go to my clinic visits. Does the participant have testing done for essential fatty acids? That is a no. My clinic does not do that. Uh, I do not take any multivitamins. And I don't take any omega-3 fatty acid supplements, nor do I take tyrosine. I'm not really taking any other supplements, but if I was, you would click yes, and we would be able to list those here. I am done, and I have one thing that I wanted to look up, and that was the lowest fee level that I can remember. So I'm going to say this is a draft. And I will be able to come back and complete this at another time. So thanks for watching me go through the treatment and diet survey. As you can see, it just took a few minutes to answer all of these questions. And we will have a chance to do some other surveys at another time. Thank you.